So here I have a power bank from the store five below. It's the 5,000 milliamp per hour power bank, but is it really 5,000 milliamp per hour? And is it safe? I buy a lot of these for my projects, but I notice they do not last very long when powering my projects. And some power banks are dead right out of the box. And once I open up the power bank to check the battery, the battery is swollen. Well, we're going to open this power bank and see if it's really 5,000 milliamps per hour. I'm going to run some tests and we're going to see if the capacity is true to what it states here, 5,000 milliamps per hour. Here is the 5 below power bank and here is the power bank that I got from Amazon. The Amazon one tells you if it's fully charged with the press of a button. On my next video I'll show you the results of the Amazon battery to see which one is better, which one is a better purchase. Uh, now let's fully discharge this uh, 5 below power bank. As you can see right out of the box, it's almost fully discharged. One thing I noticed with these power banks is that I receive them almost fully dead. And that's not a good thing because when you store these power banks, they're, they're supposed to be fully charged. Otherwise, they become damaged. I'm not sure if they're not charging them or just have a bad internal battery. They don't hold a good charge. But some that I have open are almost discharged and are already swollen, so they don't work right out of the box. So they're basically trash. About one third of the power banks that I have gotten I fight below are bad, and I have to trash them. Another reason why not to you shouldn't buy these. So my tablet has stopped charging and the voltage has dropped down to 3.2. It dropped to 2.9 and then it recovered to 3.2. So it's fully discharged. Uh, we can start taking it apart. So I'm connecting the battery alone to my charger here. It will charge it and keep track of the capacity of the battery. Last, the last digits of my device are not working properly, but we can still tell what the overall number is.
not. I have bought in so many of these and I ran the same tests on all of them. The result is always the same. The capacity is not 5000 milliamps as stated. I will not recommend using these on your expensive phones or tablets or any of your devices. The quality is bad and there is no circuit protection to protect the batteries. They will not last very long so it's better just to invest in something better. Um, if you like this video, check out my next video where I will do the same test to a similar power bank from Amazon.